Hey, look, call the f***ing fire, man. It's so far. What's good, everybody, and welcome back to Soul Priority. Of course, I'm your man, Mo, and today, first review of 2024, man, we're going to have to start this thing off with a bango, bro. Today, we're going to be taking an early look at the Travis Scott Black Olives, bro. Y'all see that right there. But before we do that, man, y'all make sure y'all heading over to Instagram and giving us a follow over there. If y'all want to know anything about our sneakers, what we got going on, sneaker news and things of that nature, man, y'all make sure y'all giving us a follow over there. And if you're new to the channel, man, y'all make sure y'all hitting that thumbs up, leaving some comments down below, and of course, subscribing to your boy's channel. Y'all already know, man, over here on YouTube, algorithm is everything and of course man y'all already know we need y'all help to make sure man we get the channel to boom it you feel me yeah sirski bro yeah sirski man y'all come on in welcome to 2024 man and again bro we got to start this thing out with a banger a banger now listen man I know I had a lot of people come over and join the channel on uh, last year, man. And I am excited for us here in the year of 2024 and all the sneakers that we're going to be taking a look at here uh, this year. So, of course, again, I had to start y'all off with something hot, fresh, right off the rip. You know what I'm saying? Now, the pattern we're going to be taking a look at today is an unauthorized pair. Okay, so we're going to be taking a look at an unauthorized pair. Now, for those of y'all that are new to my channel, Y'all already know why I already tell y'all I do retail reviews and I do unauthorized reviews here on my channel. And today's unauthorized sneaker is going to be brought to us by one of my favorite plugs, bro, Luna Lee. That's right, man. Luna Lee is back again, bro, with nothing but heat, man. Nothing but heat, man. Y'all make sure, bro, this year... Y'all checking out Luna Lee, man, because I'm telling y'all, bro, she be on top of it. And, of course, again, she keeping your boy busy, bro. I'm talking about busy, keeping me busy. So, without further ado, man, I ain't going to prolong this thing. We're going to go ahead and jump right into the sneaker, bro. And without further ado, I bring to you the Air Jordan Travis Scott collaboration, bro, the Black Olive Things. Bam! Y'all see that thing right there, bruh? This is a crazy sneaker, bro. This sneaker right here, man, I'm telling you. It gonna break a lot of people's hearts, bro. I'm just gonna be 1,000 with y'all. Now, I don't know if the Black Olive is going to be a female's release or is it going to be, um, you know, just an all-out um, release for everyone. But... From what I understand right now, man, all I can tell y'all is just be ready because it's scheduled to drop this fall, man. So, you know, hey, just be on the lookout. Again, this is just an early look at my UA pair. And y'all already know right now, man, for those of y'all that dibble and dab in the UA world, they've almost got these down packed, bro. I'm just gonna be 1,000 with y'all. The Travis Scott Air Jordan Low, they almost got it down packed. Um, the suede looks good on this pair. I mean, beautiful, bro. Hold on, let me show y'all real quick. I'm trying to get Travis out of the way. But look at the suede on this, bro. Look at the movement on that. It's crazy, bro. Got the Travis Scott sicko mode face right there on the back, man. Beautiful green olive color, man. Look at that. Y'all look at that right there, bro. Beautiful right here on the media side. Of course, y'all see the cactus jack right here behind the Nike swoosh right there. Beautiful, man. It's beautiful. I'm trying to get it to focus in so y'all can see it because it's trying to focus in on me. But there you go. Right there. Y'all see it right there, man. Beautiful, bro. Beautiful. Now, of course, y'all already know when it comes to the Travis Scott, one thing I will point out real quick about the pattern I have, the Widow's Peak on the back, it's there, but it's very small. Y'all see it right there? Now, when it comes to the Travis Scott, these widow peaks appear right here on that black on that back panel right there. So I want y'all to see right there. I do have one, but it's very, very small, bro. So that's something that they'll probably update a little bit later on, you know, as far as the reps or UAs go. You know what I'm saying? But 
the quality of this thing is crazy, bro. Again, just take a look at it. Just take a look at it. And this is what we will probably be seeing this fall, man. Now, again, this is my left sneaker right here. I'm going to try and pull this in so y'all can take a look at that. Y'all see how beautifully they did all this, bro. Y'all see that right there on the tongue, Cactus Jack right there. I'm going to let y'all take a look at the Nike. Y'all see that right there? Done right, bro. Done right. Behind the tongue. Now, I do not have a retail pair of Travis Scott's yet. You know what I'm saying? So that fun on the back, it it looked right to me. But again, I don't have a retail pair, so I don't claim to know. You know what I'm saying? Y'all tell me. All my retail people, you know what I'm saying? Y'all tell me. But as far as the quality, everything, bro, A1, I'm, they done, to me, they knocked it out of the park. The only thing that they got to, you know, like get down packed as far as these early ones is they definitely want to make that widow's peak just a little bit bigger. You know what I'm saying? But it's backed up. You know what I'm talking about? Now, with these pairs, you do get a set of heavily waxed green laces. Let y'all see it because y'all know them cheap pairs, bro. They don't be waxed with a damn. You know what I'm saying? But uh, Luna Lee gave us a great pair, bro. Y'all see it right there. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Heavily waxed black laces. Y'all see. I'm trying to get it so y'all can see the wax on the thing. Y'all see that wax right there? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And then you got a heavily waxed red pair. Y'all see that right there? Done right, bro. These laces done right, man. So y'all know this. Y'all know. Now, on the inside of the sneaker, bro, it's uh, green and black guts with a green floor in this thing, man. Y'all see it right there? Y'all see that down in there? Got that red Jordan jump, man. Let me move this shoe tree out the way for y'all real quick. There you go. There y'all go. Right there. Y'all see that right there? Beautiful, bro. Beautiful. Y'all see that right there? Man, that print look amazing, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, they, man, bro, they got these looking damn good. Damn good, bro. I ain't kidding. So, again, man, shout out Luna for getting these over to me early. Um, I know we haven't seen many pictures and we have not seen a lot. You know, I think Private Selection was the only one to post these so far. I think I seen MK posting too. But again, man, people ought to start uh getting their pairs in to show y'all. But again, man, this is the left shoe. I'm gonna go ahead now. I'm gonna show y'all the right shoe because I do not want to prolong this thing, man, because I got a lot of more sneakers to show y'all. All right. Now here is my right sneaker right here. Look at how beautiful that thing is, bro. Look at the materials. Look at this. Look at that, bro. Man, bro, Luna Lee is not playing, bro, at all. Again, toe box for my toe box people. Take a look at that stitching, bro. Take a look at how beautiful that toe box is right there. I'm talking about done well, man. Okay, let's take a look at the stars in the front. Y'all see? Stars underneath right there. Got all the stars. See what I'm talking about? And then underneath that bad boy, man, y'all already know, bro. We got that olive green bottom under the bottom of these bad boys, man. You know what I'm talking about? Now, on the back of your um right sneaker, y'all see right there, man, you got that Air Jordan Wings logo right there on the back. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm trying to get this in so y'all can see it. There you go, right there. And again... My pair do, it, it's got that, it's a widow peaked up, but it is very small. I'm pretty sure y'all can see it. Y'all, man, my camera is tripping, bro, with the focus. There we go. There we go. Y'all see it. It's there. But again, it's small, but it is there. You know what I'm saying? Take a look at the medial side. Again, look at the material. Look at the materials. This is crazy, bro. This is crazy. Um, I've seen some people claiming retail. So, I don't know if the greens that they had were, you know what I'm saying, like filtered or whatnot. So, I don't know. But to me, this looks damn good, bro. If they come in like this, it's crazy, man. And again, that midsole is a uh, sale. So, y'all see it's a sale midsole on the thing, bro. You know what I'm saying? Beautiful, bro. Beautiful. You know what I'm talking about? Definitely one that I'll be keeping in my collection. Of course, when these drop in the fall... It should be dropping for about 150 You know what I'm saying? So, y'all be on the lookout for those uh, in the fall. 
Now, I don't know about the box. Y'all already know. I like to show y'all the box or whatnot when they come in. So the box that Luna sent over is, you know, that olive box that we have been getting so far with the Travis Scott's the last, what is that, last, like last two or three drops? All the boxes have been kind of like this, you know what I'm saying? No shroud or nothing like that. So, you know, we got that brown, olive -y color Nike check and Nike on the box, you know what I'm saying? And then you got Nike right here. Of course, I'm going to let you guys take a look right there at the pricing label again on the day of release these are going for 150 size 11 for your boy yeah i'm still gonna have to get with luna about these sizes she know start sending me size 11 but uh size 11 for your boy you know what i'm talking about yeah it's Sersky right there so y'all see that and then of course nike on this side and then let's take a look underneath just like all other travis scott's bro you got that nike beverage under the bottom so um that's the box in a nutshell you know what i'm saying other than the lid right there y'all see underneath the lid right there no stamps or nothing up underneath the lid and then of course you got travis's infamous pink paper and then that white paper right there um no mold stickers or nothing like that man on the inside it's just a plain box you know what i'm talking about so for those of y'all that need a pair you know what i'm saying and don't want to wait and take that L on the day of release. Man, go on here and holler at my girl, Luna Lee. And she will definitely hook y'all up. You know what I'm talking about? Now, I'm going to take a look at these bad boys side by side. You know what I'm saying? And then we're going to get on up out this thing. You feel me? Now, again, man, here is the back of these. Y'all see right there. Travis Scott sicko mode face right there. Air Drum Wings logo. The shape is perfect. And, of course, again... Um, for those of y'all that uh looking for that widow's peak, it's there, but it's just small, bro. It's real small. You know what I'm saying? Medial side on this bad boy, clean, bro. These clean right here. I'm going to tell you. Yeah, these clean. I'm keeping these in my collection. For real, for real. All right. Medial side right there. Let y'all take a look at that Nike swoosh one more time. That tumble leather right there on that Nike swoosh. Y'all see that right there? Beautiful, man. Beautiful, bro. Take a look at it right there. Y'all see it? Nice and tumble. Stitching looks amazing. The Nike check pointed right there to that first hole like it should be. These are beautiful, man. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Let me see. Let's look at the bottoms real quick. Look at the bottoms. Y'all see the bottoms? On these bad boys, there you go, right there. Y'all see the stars, everything, Nike, these bad boys. And Luna ain't playing no game. So before you ask, nah, bro, you ain't you ain't squeezing them. You ain't squeezing them at all. Toe box, toe box. All right, y'all, we about to get on up out this thing, man. We about to get on up out this thing. Let y'all take a look at that Travis Scott Cactus Jack right there. Y'all see it? Y'all see it? And again, both of the tongues are are pretty. They 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 done right, bro. They done right. Let y'all take a look at that right there, Travis. Get out the way. I know they belong to you, bro. But you know what I'm saying. This yo, this yo sneaker, but not today. Not today. Not today. You know what I'm saying. Again, bro. Beautiful man. And I will be keeping these. <laughs> I'm going to be keeping these. They, they going up down the wall, bro. They going up down the wall. So y'all already know, man. Listen, uh, I'm going to go ahead and, and, and wrap this thing up. But I had to bring these to y'all early, man. The Travis Scott Black Olive Things, man. Um, Shout out to my people over there, Luna Lee, for uh, sending this pair over so we can take a look at what we could possibly be getting this fall for 150 from Air Jordan and Travis Scott. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Now listen, man, I ain't gonna hold y'all up. I know it is New Year's Day. Hey, just keep tuning in. We got a lot of sneakers to look at this year. We are gonna have some fun this year, bro. Uh, again, podcast gonna be going crazy this year. Y'all make sure y'all following me over there on Instagram. We gonna be doing Instagram lives over there. We moving uh, the Instagram lives from Instagram to youtube this year so sometime this year i don't know when we're gonna be moving that over here so y'all can anticipate that um it's just a whole lot gonna be going on this year man in the year of 2024 man so i hope y'all ready you know what i'm talking about yes yeah, sirski yes yeah, sirski 
Now look, man, I ain't gonna hold y'all up. I'm about to get up out this thing, man. Listen, y'all already know they blessed out there. Stay doing your thing, man. And of course, y'all already know what I say. Hey, I will see you guys in the next review, man. I'm about this thing, y'all. I am gone.